prep zone. Oh my goodness! Price splash down. Welcome to the Prep Zone. My name is Grant Yenny. Tonight we have district volleyball action as Fountain Blue travels to take on the Mandeville Lady Skippers. I spoke with both coaches moments ago. Let's hear what they had to say and we'll get to the action. Free game with Coach Dennis. Coach, last time we saw your team was against North Shore. How's your team progressed since then? Um, I think we're still pretty much in the same spot. Uh, we had some tough losses against some tough teams. Um, those back-to-back -back nights are, are kind of catching up to us. Um, but I still think we're in the same place. I still think we need a good, complete game from all of our players. That goes for our blockers, defenders, and our hitters. Yeah, it's a rivalry match against uh, Fountain Blue. Um, what's it going to take to beat them? It's going to take a lot. It's, uh, we're expecting, um, again, if the ninth grade and JV games or anything, any indication, it's going to be a battle. Um, but it's going to take a good effort. Uh, it, like you said, it's a rival game. It's always an intense matchup between these two schools. Uh, a lot of friends on both sides, so um, it should be a fun night. Right, pre game with Coach Mule. Coach, last time we saw your team was week one. Uh, how's your team progressed since then? Well, we definitely got better with service receive. So uh, week one was a rough one, but we've definitely improved. We've come a long way. We've been working hard. You know, we, we pulled out some really good wins here and there, and um, the kids are just ready to play. What's it going to take to beat Mandeville here in this rivalry matchup tonight? Well, it's going to play take and being consistent. You know, we, we've we always played tough against each other, and we have to play our game. No matter what we do, we can't, we can't focus on what they're doing. We just have to play our game. Turner Bergeron to kick this one off. Serve there. Yeah. And the kill by Alex Shefflin to get us started. Mandeville up 1-0. This will bring up Hannah Hunter to serve for the Lady Skippers. Hunter number two for kills on the team with 72. Free ball over for the Lady Bulldogs. Tipped over there by V Hill. Now Alfonso with the tip. And Shefflin with another kill. That was Shefflin's 51st kill of the season. Oh, and that one is over. Excellent job there not giving up on it. And knocked down by V Hill and V Hill with the kill. The 6 1 senior nominated for the academic All State team has a 35 on her ACT. She's also the Mandeville Kills leader. Alfonso sends that one long. Well, wait, you have one judge saying it's in, the other one saying it was out. The uh, officials are going to rule that it was out. So Mandeville continues to serve here with Hunter. And that one goes long. And that one pulls way to the right. Over there to the Fountain Blue cheering section. 4-2. Lady Skipper's up. 
Warren. And this will be a free ball sent over by Shefflin. And the kill. Oh. Well, nearly a kill. It was an excellent job by the Lady Skippers to pop it back up, but it ended up being four touches. 4-3 now as Fountain Blues battled back. And that one goes long. Tied up, 4-4 here in the first. Pelto serving. The service error gives Mandeville the lead once again. And it brings up Alex Shefflin to serve. Free ball from Plaisance. Warren, Hill, and the dig by Pelto. They'll go for it again, and now changing up the pace. Hill tips it over and gets it behind the Fountain Blue front line, 6-4. This one tipped over, and they're gonna call a double on the Lady Skippers. This brings up Hannah Ellis. the junior setter. Popped up and B Hill sends it out of bounds. And it's tied up six apiece. Dig there for Pelto. And Alfonso with the kill. So now Fountain Blue has taken the lead. 7-6 here in the first as Ellis continues to serve. Free ball over from Warren. Dig from Marquez. And that one goes into the net. 8-6, Lady Bulldogs leading. And tipping that one over is Mason V. Hill. It falls to the floor. 8 7. Fountain Blue leading. Let's bring up sophomore Kinsley Wyndham to serve. Warren. And the kill for Kate Bellows. And it's tied up 8-8. Eight, eight. So Wyndham will serve again. She's a Fellowship of Christian Athletes ambassador. She also volunteers with the Miracle League. And V Hill slams that one down. And the Lady Skippers reclaim the lead 9-8 here in the first. And that one kept in. Warren to V Hill. Pushed over. Tipped over there by Warren. 
Plaisance. Mempelos with the kill. 10-8, Lady Skippers leading here in the first. Bellows, one of the senior captains on the Mandeville team. And that one goes into the net. Windham with the serve. And that one blocked down by Lange and Alfonso. So Alfonso serving for the Lady Bulldogs. Back set, V Hill went to send it here, uh, kind of cross court. Instead it hit the tape and rolled over. Falls on the Mandeville side, 11-10. Mandeville still leading. Alfonso looking to tie it up here. Free ball over from Marquez. And blocked down by V Hill. 12 10. Lady Skippers here in the first. Marquez with the serve. Bergeron tips it over. And Bellows with the kill. 13-10, Lady Skippers. And the kill for Marley Lange. Let's bring up Gabby Plaisance to serve. Great eye there from Wyndham. Watched it the whole way at the last second, turned, lets it go out of bounds past that back line. 14-11, Lady Skippers. Freeman tips it over. And a kill for Alfonso. Fourteen twelve, Lady Skippers leading. Whitney Reed to serve. Free ball from uh, Hunter. Excellent job diving there by Wyndham. And free ball from Warren. And Alfonso. Big hit there. Uh, Marquez. Couldn't handle it, it went rogue. Falls to the floor, point for the Lady Bulldogs. 14-13, Reed looking to tie it up. Dig there by Plaisance. And Bergeron with the kill. Banking it off of the Mandeville block attempt, and it's tied up 14-14 here in the first. Wow. 
And that one gets over. And nobody home there. Fountain Blue reclaims the lead, 15-14. Good eye by Marquez letting that one go and it's tied back up 15-15. This brings up senior captain Kate Bellows to serve. Tipped over by Pelto. And Fountain Blue takes the lead again, 16-15. Ellis to Alfonso to the floor. Ali Alfonso with the kill. Bergeron serving. Hunter tips it over. Alfonso's ready for it. Ellis with the tip. And this one going rogue and out of bounds to the point for the Lady Skippers. Hunter serves it. And that one falls to the floor, tied back up, 17 apiece. Communication error there. And Mandeville leads 18-17. Ellis with the back set. A free ball from Shefflin. Ellis to Pelto. And the point for the Lady Skippers makes it 19-17. And Coach Mule takes time out to talk it over with her team here in the first. Coming out of the timeout, Mandeville leading 19-17 here in the first. Alfonso sends that one long. Mandeville leading 20 to 17 as Hunter comes up to serve. Ellis with the back set. And that one blocked by Pelto and Ellis. And it brings up Pelto to serve. And V Hill with the kill. 21 18. And you're by far the kill's leader for the Lady Skippers. More than 130. And that one goes long. 22 18. Warren, and the kill for Riley Edwards. And that was Riley Edwards' 50th kill of the season. And another timeout on the floor as Mandeville leads 23-18.
Coming out of the timeout, Shefflin serving for the Lady Skippers. And a free ball from Plaisance. That one goes into the net, and it is set point here in the first. And that one is an ace for Shefflin, and Mandeville takes set one, 25-18. Hunter serving to kick off set two. This one will be at the net. Shefflin with the kill. So Mandeville on the board first here in set two. And that's an ace for Hunter. Mandeville up 2-0 here in the second. And a kill for Pelto. Fountain Blue on the board. And Pelto will serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And a kill for Riley Edwards, her second of the night. Shefflin, powerful serve there. Ellis. And they're going to call uh, Mandeville in the net. So that will bring up the junior setter, Hannah Ellis, to serve. Hits the tape, rolls over Marquez there to save it. And that one hit well into the descent. Sends it into the net. Marquez, this free ball needs to get over. It doesn't make it. And Fountain Blue has taken the lead 4-3 here in the second. Alfonso dropping the hammer there. The kill for the Lady Bulldogs, 5-3. Fountain Blue up. And putting the roof on it there is Marley Lange. Brooke Fridge checks in as Hemelai comes out. V Hill tips it over behind the. Uh, first line of defense there for Fountain Blue. The back support not there. Falls to the ground. 6-4, Lady Bulldogs leading. And it brings up Kinsley Wyndham to serve. And the kill for Marley Lange. Seven four, Lady Bulldogs lead. Wow. 
Warren set to be Hill, tips it over. Alfonso ready for it. Bergeron blocked back by B. Hill. And that one hit way too low, goes into the net. Marquez with the serve. Dig there by Pelto. And that one sent long. So Mandeville one away from tying it up. Now one hits the Mandeville cheering section. And it's tied up seven apiece here in the second. Tipped over. Excellent diving effort. Warren tips it over. And Bergeron sent that one just past the back line. And Mandeville reclaims the lead 8-7. Ellis tips it over. Bellows with the kill. Number four for Bellows tonight. And Mandeville leads 9-7. Lange tips it over, punched back by Warren. Blocked back by Lange. Excellent job by Wyndham with the dig. And that's in right in that far corner. Bergeron with the kill. So Gabby Plaisance to serve. And that one hit right on the edge of the sideline. Tied up nine apiece here in the second. And Bergeron with the kill. And Fountain Blue reclaims the lead 10 9. Bellows with the kill. That's number five on the night for the senior captain. And it's tied up 10 apiece here in the second. Warren with the serve. And Pelto packing a punch there with the kill. Fountain Blue leading 11-10 here in the second. And a communication error there. 12-10, Fountain Blue leads. And Shefflin with the kill.
Good communication there and a free ball from Edwards. Dig there for Marquez. And too much under that one. Fountain Blue leads 13-11. Tipped over. And Alfonso sends the free ball. And that one slammed down by Hannah Hunter. And Hunter heads back to serve for the Lady Skippers. Alfonso hits that one over. And the kill for Shefflin. And it's tied up 13 apiece here in the second. That one goes long, and Mandeville reclaims the lead 14-13. Blocked by Pelto and Alfonso to tie it up 14-14. Pelto heads back to serve. V Hill tips it over. And a block there by Mason V Hill. So Mandeville leads 15-14. That one, B Hill slapped it down. It was popped back up and rides the net and falls on the opposite side. Point for the Lady Bulldogs, 15-15 here in the second. Ellis with the serve, and that's an ace for Ellis. That was an unprotected area. Warren was closer to the middle, and uh, Fridge was a little too far back. Ellis floated it right to the perfect spot there for the ace. And a kill for V Hill. 16-16. Wyndham with the serve. And Lange with the kill. That one ricocheted over to almost to our broadcast position here. And Fountain Blue reclaims the lead 17-16 here in the second. Ali Alfonso up to serve. And a kill for B Hill. Marquez serves, and that one goes long. So Fountain Blue reclaims the lead on the service error. 
And it brings up Gabby Plaisance. And another service error. So trading service errors. And we're tied up 18-18. Ellie Warren. And that's in. Yeah, right at the uh, near corner. Fountain Blue takes the lead, 19-18. Whitney Reed. The junior for Coach Mule serving. And Bergeron sends that one long. 19-19. Both teams trading points here in the second. Mandeville took the first one, 25-18. The dig there by Alfonso. And a kill for Bergeron. So Bergeron serving here. And that one out just past the uh, sideline here in front of the Fountain Blue bench area. And Fountain Blue leads 21-19 here in the second. That one goes long. 22-19. And we have a timeout on the court here in the second. Coming out of the timeout, it's Turner Bergeron serving, and that one hits the antenna. So Hannah Hunter will serve for the Lady Skippers. Alfonso tips it over, and a point for the Lady Bulldogs. Excellent job there, changing up the pace on it. Wide open spot in the middle of the court there. Ball tipped to it and out of reach of the diving Lady Skippers. 23-20. And Edwards with the kill. Brings up Alex Shefflin to serve. The lefty gets it over. And that one blocked down by V Hill. 23 22. And a timeout once again on the floor here in the second. Shefflin with the serve coming out of the timeout. Alfonso tips that one over. Warren, V Hill tips it over and it falls to the floor. And it's tied up 23 23. Ellis to Alfonso and it's blocked down by V Hill, and Mandeville takes the lead, 24-23. Shefflin with the serve. This one needs to get over, Plaisance gets it there. Tipped by V Hill, Ellis ready for it. 
Warren. Pelto ready for it. Back set to Hill. And Lange. That one goes long and Mandeville takes set two, 25-23. Plaisons to serve, kicking off set three. And that one goes long. Fountain Blue is on the, oh, they say Fountain Blue touched it. So Mandeville on the board first. Pivotal set three. Is Mandeville gonna keep the foot on the gas and have an early night? Or is Fountain Blue gonna fight back here and force extras? Hunter with the serve. Warren. It's left over by Bergeron. Warren ready for it. And that one out of bounds in front of the Mandeville bench. Hunter with the serve. And the kill for Ava Freerman. That one goes long. 2-2 two, two here in the third. And diving effort there by Plaisance. Marquez with the dig. Tipped over by Shefflin. Edwards tips it over. Plaisance with the dig. Ellis with the back set over the net. That one goes long. Mandeville reclaims the lead, 3-2. Shefflin serving following the break. And that one goes long. I think Fountain Blue wanted a touch called. Service goes long, 4-3. So Turner Bergeron back to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And Trevihill drops the hammer. 5-3, Lady Skippers. Service there from Wyndham. That one goes into the net. Mandeville leading 6-3 here in the third. Oh, 
pushed back. That one blocked down by V Hill. And it's 7 3, Lady Skippers. And a kill for Carmen Pelto. 7-4. Warren to V Hill, and that one goes long right in front of the Fountain Blue bench area. Sent over by Bellows. Punched up. Up. Oh, Mandeville is going to be called in the net. So Fountain Blue one away from tying this one up here in pivotal set three. And that one goes into the net. Ricochets off of the Fountain Blue block attempt and falls out of bounds. 9-6, Lady Skippers. And that one blocked by Lange and Ellis. 9-7, Lady Skippers. Hannah Ellis up to serve. And a service error. And Lane's dropping the hammer. Ten eight, Lady Skippers leading. This brings up uh, Ali Alfonso to serve. And Hunter with the kill. Kate Bellows serving. This one hit the net, and that's an ace for Bellows. Coach Mule is going to take a timeout to talk it over with their team as Mandeville leads 12-8 here in the third. Bellows with the serve coming out of the timeout. And Frereman with the kill. Twelve nine, Lady Skippers, with the junior libero Gabby Plaisance up to serve, and Hunter with the kill right on that far sideline. Hunter serves it. That one blocked back. Bergeron and Pelto. <clears throat> A 
Whitney Reed to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And that one goes out of bounds. 13-11 as Fountain Blue looks to battle back here in the third. Popped over by Warren. Diving effort kept in play. Bello sends it over. Excellent second effort there by Bergeron. And Shefflin with the kill. Shefflin's seventh kill of the night. And Mandeville leads 14 to 11. And Pelto with the kill. Is that one ricocheted up to the rafters, changed the trajectory a little bit, and falls to the floor. Turner Bergeron serving now. And that one goes long. Mandeville looking for a touch, no call. Fountain Blue with him one of tying it up. Tipped over by Pelto. And that one hit out of bounds by Hill. Tied up 14-14 here in the third. Bergeron continues to serve. B. Hill tips it over, and that's going to be a lift called on the Lady Bulldogs. So Mandeville reclaims the lead. Wyndham checks in to serve. And putting the roof on it is Mason V. Hill. Sixteen fourteen Lady Skippers lead. Dig there by Hamawai. Diving effort there by Marquez to keep it up. And that one sent long by Bellows. 16-15, Lady Skippers with Carmen Pelto up to serve. And V Hill with the kill. 17-15, quickly off the court is V Hill. Hunter comes on. V Hill telling her team, let's keep this going. They're up 17-15. And a free ball from Bellows. Tip over, Wyndham ready for it. And Hunter, excellent vision there. Tipped it to the undefended area of the court. And Mandeville leads 18-15. That's a kill for Carmen Pelto. That one's splitting defenders, hits at the back line. And a free ball. Good communication there from Kinsley Wyndham. 
Lange with the tip, Warren ready for it. Tipped back. And Alfonso with the kill. Eighteen seventeen. Fountain Blue looking to tie it up right here. And that one goes out of bounds. It's tied up. Eighteen eighteen. Ellis with the serve. And that one goes into the net. Now Fountain Blue has taken the lead and Coach Dennis will take a timeout. Ellis with the serve. Coming out of the timeout, Hunter tips it. Tipped up by Bellows. And wow, that one popped up by Hamilai, and this one needs to get over. Bellows gets it there. Tipped over by Alfonso, and that one falls to the court as Fountain Blue leads 20 to 18 here in the third. Neely Roy checks in as Bellows comes out. Floats over. Hunter drops the hammer. Fountain Blue leading 20 to 19. Alex Shefflin checks in. And uh, Ellie Warren is back to serve. Popped up and over by Roy, but it goes to the opposite side of the court and out of bounds. Twenty-one nineteen. With Ali Alfonso back to serve. And a free ball from Hunter. And Lange there missed time the jump and swing. Twenty-one twenty. Pushed over. And that one blocked down by Lange and Freerman. Twenty-two twenty. Lady Bulldogs as Plaisance will serve. And for the Lady Skippers, Fridge checks in as Roy comes out. And Hunter, excellent diving effort there by Plaisance. That one goes into the net and falls to the floor. Mason Behill checks back in up front as Hunter will serve. The dig by Hunter. An excellent diving effort there by Plaisons to keep it in play. And that one goes. Warren. Popped up. And a free ball from Edwards. Tipped up by V Hill. Warren with the free ball. 
Back set, Bergeron with the tip. Tip from V Hill. And a free ball from Alfonso. Blocked at the net. Knocked down by V Hill. Ellis. And that one goes into the net. And it's tied up. 22 22. What a rally there. That one back and forth. Neither team wanted to let it hit the ground. And Coach Mule takes a timeout to talk it over with her squad. Tied up score here in the third. 22 22, a fired up crowd here at Mandeville High School following that previous rally. And it's tipped over by uh, Frereman. And Fountain Blue reclaims the lead 23-22. Found a gap in the front line and pushed it right through. And Plaisance with the dig and the ricochet back over to the Mandeville side. Warren, V Hill with the tip. And Edwards with the kill. And it's tied up once again, Jefflin with the serve, it goes into the net. 24-23. So set point here in the third. Here in pivotal set three. Are we going to extras? Or is Mandeville going to come back here? We'll find out after the timeout. 24-23 here in the third. Bergeron serving here on set point for the Lady Bulldogs. V Hill tips it over. Edwards pushes it over. And V Hill, oh, it's popped back up. And that's going to be a double called on Fountain Blue. So we're tied up 24-24 here in the third. Kinsley Wyndham back to serve. And that one goes into the net. So Mandeville takes the lead, 25-24. And it's match point. Wyndham with the serve. Tipped over, tied up again. What a match this is. Golly. 25-25 here in the third. With Pelto back to serve. B. Hill tips it out of bounds. Set point for the Lady Bulldogs. Thank you. 
B. Hill with the tip. Tipped over, Warren. Diving effort, keeps it up. Big hit there from Roy. And that one tipped into the antenna. 26-26. Ella Marquez back to serve for the Lady Skippers. Lange punches that one over. And that one goes long. Match point for the Lady Skippers. Ella Marquez serving. Service over. And this will be a free ball from Plaisance. Hunter tips it over. Now a tip from Alfonso. 27-27. Wow. This brings up Hannah Ellis to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. Hunter drops the hammer for the kill. Twenty-eight, twenty-seven. Match point for the Lady Skippers with Ellie Warren up to serve. Tipped over by Alfonso. Here's Warren back to Shefflin, knocked back. Roy tips it over. Hunter to Shefflin. Lange with the tip, kept up. Wyndham sends it over. Lange with the tip once again. Warren back to Shefflin. And that's out, past the back line. 28-28 here in the third. Now Fonzo will serve for the Lady Bulldogs. Warren, Hunter, and a kill for Hunter. Match point with Neely Roy up to serve. Tipped over. And this one needs to get, it gets there and a double called on the Lady Skippers. 29-29 here in the third. And that one goes long. 30. 30-31. Lady Skippers leading with Hannah Hunter up to serve. Pelto with the kill. 30-30. Whitney Reed back to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And that's an ace for Reed. 30. Set point for the Lady Bulldogs. Reed with the service again. Warren 
and B. Hill slams it down. Pelto with the tip, diving effort. And a free ball from Edwards. And Fountain Blue. Oh no, it's still in play. Oh my goodness, it was popped up. Bergeron there, puts away the set, and Fountain Blue takes it 32 to 30. So we're now into a fourth set after witnessing a 32-30 Fountain Blue victory in the third, and Fountain Blue is on the board first here in the fourth with the kill from Prayerman. My goodness, I've never, I don't think I've ever seen a score that high. Dave Williams, have you? No. Blocked back. Diving effort goes into the net and it'll go under. Point for the Lady Skippers. Teams have been trading points all night. First set, 25-18 Mandeville. Second set, 25-23 Mandeville. Third set, 32-30 Fountain Blue. And now we're here in the fourth, tied up 1-1. Warren to Edwards. And that one blocked down by V Hill. So Alex Shefflin serving. Seven kills on the night for the senior. And a kill for Riley Edwards, her fifth of the night. 3-1, Mandeville up here in the fourth. And not enough power under that one. Shefflin continuing to serve. And that is an ace for Shefflin. Back set from Ellis and Bergeron with the kill as that one ricochets up. Bergeron back to serve. Warren, V Hill blocked back. And Warren will send a free ball and that'll go out of bounds on the far sideline. V Hill with the tip and that falls to the floor. 6-3, Lady Skippers lead here in the fourth. Kinsley Windham up to serve. Dig there from Wyndham, knocked back by Pelto. 6-4, Lady Skippers with Pelto back to serve. Popped up, this one needs to get over and it gets there. Bellow sends the free ball. 
And that one out of bounds off of the ricochet. The block attempt there from Bellows and Behill. B. Hill tips it over. And the point for the Lady Skippers. Makes it 7-5. And that one blocked down by Hannah Hunter. Marquez continues to serve. And that one goes long. 9-5, Lady Skippers. Marquez continuing to serve. And Lange with the kill. That'll bring up Hannah Ellis to serve. Bellows tips it up. And Lange tips it over the point for the Lady Bulldogs. And that one goes long. 9-8 as Fountain Blues battled back. Can tie it up right here with Ellis serving. And that one goes long. Good eye from uh, Marquez. Rareman tips it over, diving effort from Warren. This one needs to get over, and Lange puts the roof on it. That brings up Ali Alfonso to serve. I think there's a spot on the floor that needs to be wiped up. So Alex Shefflin will handle that real quick. And Alfonso will serve here for the Lady Bulldogs. Warren and Lange ties it up, 10-10. Turner pops it over. Diving effort from Alfonso. And Freerman with the kill. And Fountain Blue takes the lead, 11-10. Service pulls out of bounds, ties it up 11 to 11. Ellis back set the Freerman.
kept up, amazing diving effort from Marquez, and the free ball gets over. Here's Shefflin, sends that one long, and Fountain Blue reclaims the lead 12-11. Gabby Plaisant serving. And that one sent long. So trading service errors. It's tied up 12 apiece. Brooke Fridge checks in. As Roy comes out. Kept up, and a free ball from Warren. Dig there from Fridge. And that one goes out of bounds for the Fountain Blue point. That was an excellent job there by Ava Freerman. The ball was uh, set behind her. She turned around, kind of had to reroute to get the ball back over for the Lady Bulldogs. Excellent job there by the sophomore. And Whitney Reed with the serve. And V Hill with the kill. Tied up 13 apiece here in the fourth. This is the way it's been all match, just trading points. And that one goes long. 14-13, Lady Skippers. Warren back set, V-Hill tips it over. And a point for the Lady Skippers. Riley Edwards hit that one over. Last touched by a Fountain Blue player. Mandeville leads 15-13 here in the fourth. And we have a timeout on the floor. Coming out of the timeout, Shefflin serving. Warren, that one blocked back. Fridge ready for it though. And that one goes long over to the Fountain Blue cheering section. Addie Hemawai checks in, the other senior captain for the Lady Skippers. <clears throat> Tip. Popped up by Fridge. And a free ball from Hamawai. And that one knocked down by Mason Vihill. So Mandeville leads 16-14 here in the fourth. And Kinsley Wyndham goes back to serve as Neely Roy checks in up front. Dig there from Hamawai. This one needs to get over. Hamawai gets it there. V Hill tips it over. Plaisant, diving effort there, gets it over. And a point for the Lady Skippers as Ellie Warren hits that one over. Mandeville leads 17 14 here in the fourth.
Ellis caught Mandeville off guard there. Saw an opportunity, they were expecting a set. She does a back set over the net, tipping it over in a panic. Mandeville goes for it, touches it, and it hits the ground. 17-15, Mandeville leading. Good job by Marquez with the dig. V Hill tips it over. Another tip from V Hill. And V Hill with the kill. 18 15. Lady Skippers leading. Ellis to Lange with the tip. Tipped over by Hunter. Warren, Hunter, that might have been a double, no call. And that one blocked back. Out of bounds. And Coach Mule takes a timeout. Mandeville leading 19-15. Coming out of the timeout, Mandeville leading 19-15 here in the fourth. Alfonso with the tip. And that one up to the ceiling and back down. Neely Roy with the kill. Ellis over to Alfonso. And Roy. Alfonso, free ball. Pushed over by Warren. Ellis sends it right back. And Hunter sends it out of bounds. Twenty sixteen, Mandeville leading. Here in the fourth, Hannah Ellis back to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And Alfonso with the kill. Makes it 20 to 17. Warren, Hunter pushes it over. Alfonso pushes it. And a free ball from Hunter. Roy slaps it over, met at the net. Roy once again, and Roy with the kill. That one ricocheting off of Freeman. 21-17, Lady Skippers up with Ellie Warren back to serve. And that one goes long. Good eye from the sophomore, Wyndham, letting that one go. Warren with the serve. Back set, Shefflin. And that'll be four touches.
Warren with the serve. That one pushed over. Great diving effort there by Warren. Shefflin with the free ball. And Lange puts the roof on it. This will bring up Ali Alfonso to serve for the Lady Bulldogs. And Hunter with the kill. And it's match point here in the fourth. With Neely Roy serving for the Lady Skippers. And that is a free ball from Alfonso. Warren, is that gonna be a, a double called on the Lady Skippers? Brooke Fridge checks in. And uh, Gabby Plaisance will serve for the Lady Bulldogs. Floats it. Warren. Hunter. Plaisance with the dig. That one sent over by Warren. Warren. Now Ellis Pelto tips it. And Shefflin has it blocked back, but Mandeville keeps it up. And this one blocked back once again. Warren to Shefflin, blocked back again. And that will go out of bounds for the Lady Bulldog point, 24-20. Mandeville leading here in the fourth. Plays on with the serve. Hunter drops the hammer, and Mandeville takes the match, winning set four, 25 to 20. Let's send our thank yous to those who helped bring you this match, starting with our superintendent, Mr. Frank Jabia, director of broadcasting, Dr. Melody Menard, cameraman, editor and coordinator of Channel 13, Dave the Rave Williams from Mandeville High School, where the Mandeville Lady Skippers beat Fountain Blue in four. My name is Grant Yenny. Good night.